Hi, we're here at the Zenith Aircraft Factory, and we have our new toy with us here that we'll be bringing to Oshkosh shortly. Uh, Roger, why don't you tell us a little bit about what is this airplane and what does it do? This is the Stoll CH750 Super Duty. And uh, what makes it super and what makes it duty, or what makes it super duty? Well, what we've done is we've taken our 750 aircraft and, and we, we beefed up a lot of the parts, made the wings a little bigger, bigger tail section, and now we have a, a larger engine too, whereas O200 was very popular in the 750. This airplane here has the IO375, which is 205 horse. And you know, the Stoll CH750 was really optimized for the sport pilot category, you know, for sport pilot license. And now with basic med, uh, we're hearing a lot from pilots that uh, say, hey, we, uh, we love the Stoll airplane, but we'd like to be able to carry more weight, put a bigger engine. And that's really the reason behind the Super Duty, is really a pickup truck version of our Stoll, which is a light sport version of the airplane. And uh, tell us a little bit more about the features on this aircraft. Project. Well, there's a, uh, the landing gear is a little bit different too than the 750 Stoll. We have a more of a rounded gear larger tires, uh, we have uh, streamlined struts which are standard on the kit, and then our new bubble glass doors, new latching system, and then our new featured cockpit instruments. And uh, the cabin on this airplane is quite a bit different when you look inside, and the first thing you'll notice when you come in a little bit is we've taken the instrument panel right out of the aircraft. And, uh, we've the reason we've done this is we've replaced it with basically a full uh, glass panel display from Avolution and uh, it's really reconfigurable. We think customers and, and pilots will really like it because it, uh, it allows us to, uh, to fly and configure and put the, air, the panel where we want rather than having to look at, at an arbitrary panel in front of us. And uh, so that's something we're, we're, and we'll go fly it shortly and uh, kind of explain that a little bit more. Now if you look behind the seats, also very different, you'll notice a jump seat right back there. Tell us about that, Roger. Well, the jump seat is uh, limited to 200 pounds, and a lot of this depends on your CG and your weight and balance. Uh, but you can go up to 200 pounds. Um, got plenty of room for a, a young adult or a, a young child. Um, it makes it e it's very easy to get in and out, especially with the larger tires. Uh, lots of room for baggage for camping. So it's a very, very nice. And we really love that visibility. Being a being a center jump seat, you can actually see forward quite well because you're not right behind the passenger or the or the pilot, so it uh, really works out quite well. Really look forward to flying that more. Now we've recently just finished our flying off for 40 hours and we'll be heading to Oshkosh with it, with this airplane for the first time. So look forward to showing this airplane next week.